Monday Minute. We continue the series of four things I learned from youth sports that I use in business leadership. And today we talk about making it personal. What motivates people? You know, when you're coaching youth athletics as a coach, you have to get into the head of each of your players and understand what it is that motivates them. Are they the kind that needs a gentle whisper in the ear and a pat on the back? Or do they need a kick in the rear? Or they, do they respond to, to yelling in, 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 in loud voices? Or do they respond to calmness? You know, as a coach, each kid responds differently and you have to figure that out to get the most out of them. Well, in business, the same thing applies. You have to figure out what it is that motivates your people. You know, I've had many salespeople work for me and, and they're not all motivated by money. Oh, don't get me wrong, we all want to make money, but, but they are also motivated by other things. I had one who, you know, just wanted to be the best or wanted to be at the top of the list. You know, wanted to be recognized for being better than everyone else, always at the number one ranking. You know, I had others that were just solely motivated by money. I had some that were motivated by just helping others. So get into the head of your people. Get to know your people and find out what it is that motivates them. And then utilize that to get the best out of them. Because when you get the best out of them, you get the best out of your company. And it makes your life so much easier as a leader or as an owner. Thanks for listening to this Monday Minute. We'll be right back here next Monday. I'm Steve Beers, the Growth Coach, Texas Golf.